Hey guys, what's up? Hetrop here again from Geek Spectrum, and today I'm going to show you how to install two add-ons that are widely used throughout Gmod. The first one being PHX or Phoenix Storms, and the other one being WireMod. Um, I think this is going to be like my 14th attempt at this tutorial because YouTube keeps giving me some random errors each time I upload it and I have to remake it all over again. So let's go. Let's do this. All right. So first, you're going to want to go to Google and search up Tortoise SVN. Then uh, click the first link. Then click download. And then depending on what type of what version of Windows you have or what sort of windows you have, 32-bit, 64-bit, you're going to click on uh, the link corresponding to that, and you're going to download it, and it's a pretty straightforward install. It's going to ask you to restart at the end. Um, just restart it. Um, also, if you're going to restart, either remember this link, remember uh, Geek Spectrum, all right, or uh, bookmark this so you could easily navigate back um, yeah that kinda sounds like I'm trying to advertise a bit ah, whatever um, so once you do that uh, your computer restarted and everything get your computer restarted and everything yeah go to Google again and search up Gmod wiki then click the first link and you should see a bunch of different links. All these things are pretty interesting, um, pretty helpful, random tutorials as well. But what we're interested in is the add-ons home. So you're going to click that, then click add-ons list. So here there's a huge list of add-ons. Um, yeah. We're only interested in these two, though, these top two. So, first we're going to install uh, WireMod. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to grab the SVN download link. Then you're going to copy it. And then make a folder on your desktop. And call it Wire. Oh, is there a check mark there already? Okay. So, in wire, you're going to right click on the folder wire and hit SVN checkout. And then you're going to paste in the SVN download link and just hit OK. Alrighty. And while this is downloading and throwing all the folders, and files into here. Um, go and navigate to your computer um, wherever you installed Steam, Steam apps, username, Gary's Mod, Gary's Mod, add ons. Is that almost done? Nah, it's about halfway there. And here you're going to want to make a folder called PHX and hit enter. Ooh, it's pretty close. Okay. Um, and I would also recommend creating a shortcut to the add-ons folder and throwing that on your desktop somewhere. Oh. Eh. Uh, Oh no, I hate this thing. There it is. Okay, so I was wrong. It wasn't halfway done. But it's getting there. It was like 20 something. Um, that group has been advertising giveaways all day. Alright. Alright, so I think it's about close to being finished 
20 megabytes would it be? Meh. Alright, so we got the add-ons. And it's finished. Now, with the PHX folder, you're going to want to go back to the add-on list and grab the SVN download link for this. And I think I highlighted more than just the link. So you copy, right click, SVN checkout, and paste it. And I'm going to pause this and start recording again after this is done because this takes roughly 10 minutes for me. So once this is done, I will begin recording. Hey guys, I'm back. Um, so it took me 13 minutes to download and install. Um, I think I have like three minutes left in recording, so I'm going to make this quick. All right, so once it's done, hit OK. Then go to your wire folder, which you made on your desktop. And you're going to grab the advanced dupe, wire, and wire model pack one. To select multiple things at once, just hold down control and click on them. So I got those selected. What you're going to want to do is you're going to drag that into your Gary's Mod, Gary's Mod add-ons folder. And this should take like a couple minutes. Um, and while that's transferring over, oh, it finished. Um, Alright, so, yeah, you got all that done, and you're good to go. Uh, also, you can go to garysmod.org and search up if different add-ons. I would recommend getting Easy Precision and uh, Smart Snap. Um, but I don't have enough time to show you how to install those. It's pretty much the same thing minus SVN and just clicking and dragging a folder into add-ons. Um, but I hope this helped. Um, if you guys really want me to, I'll make another tutorial in how to install Easy Precision and Smart Snap, but those are pretty straightforward, so yeah. See you later, and once again, hope this helped, and enjoy your new add-ons.